What's good, peeps? It's your boy T Sticks, and thank you for watching this video. Um, if you've selected this video, then chances are you're having issues with a corrupt download or something of that nature. And at the end of this video, I'm hoping that you'll have a better understanding of how to fix that and to move forward with your downloads. So, uh, without further ado, let's get into it. Um, I tried to download this one before, and I was having a couple issues with it. The download is scanning for viruses before it officially downloads to the computer. Alright, so our download has finally completed, and uh, just before I move on, this icon here, this is the, uh, the zip file icon um, for the application that I downloaded, WinWar, um, which is W-I-N-R-A-R. Um, that is how I extract all of my zip files and expand them to the size that they're supposed to be. So from the uh, one gigabyte that we saw, this particular download for part two could actually be 10 gigabytes or 20 gigabytes but it's all been compressed down into one gigabyte which makes it easier to download and to transfer um, if you need to send it through email or so forth and so on um, also uh, this particular icon was um, just a blank piece of paper um, if you can imagine what that looks like like a piece of computer paper um, that's all that was the icon and I had to go through and associate a uh, an application to this particular download which was my original um, issue with that and in order to do that if you are having that problem all you would do is come over to your file explorer go to downloads um, wherever your download is you can right click course wait for it to do its thing and by the way this is the one that I just downloaded as you see today and then it'll show today's date behind this pop-up properties and here is where I came to uh, where it says open with This was under something else and I had to physically um, link it to WinWar, the archiver. So kind of go back out of this and then of course you have your advanced um, settings. You can unblock, block, uh, so many different things. Security, your details, previous versions it tells you about all that. But I'm going to get out of here and actually open up this file. Actually, I'll do it from here just so that you all can see that you're able to open it up from the actual download browser. And as you see, um, I get the unexpected end of archive uh, error message that comes up. Of course, it's going to try to make you pay for it. I have not paid for this since I um initially installed this app i want to say back in 2017-18 and it works perfectly all right so from here i'm just going to go ahead and close out of that um and here's the window of all the folders that's within the part two download I'm going to attempt to click on the bell. That error is going to come back up. And then you can go back up a level, up a level, up a level. Um, then I'll just go into another folder just so that you all can see I'm going to have the same issues. That's a problem. I'm just going to click out of that entire thing. Alright, so I'm going to come over here and open up the file that I downloaded today, part 2. I get the unexpected error. Of course, I do not want to purchase the online. And what I'm going to do here is 
because I don't see repair up here. This is the root folder um, with all the subfolders with inside. I'm just going to come out. Here's the old 2 file on part 2. And then I'm going to hit repair. And then you can select which folder, where do you want the new version to go. Okay. All right, so that actually did not take long at all. It only took maybe two minutes. So I'm gonna come here and close that. And now you see in the front, it says rebuild, noise, so forth and so on. Oh, to file, today's date. So I'm actually going to close out of this folder. I see it here. Same download, but I'm gonna come in. No, I do not want to purchase anything. I'm gonna take a minute for that application to open. There's a lot going on in this computer, so it does run a little sluggish. And then from here, you're able to extract it to whatever folder or wherever you would like. You can select where you want it to go. For me personally, I come down here, and we're going to select part two. Okay. So all of my files are being transferred over to part two and it will show in the same folder manner as the way it is set up in the uh, zip file where it had the three subfolders. All right, so going into the uh, rebuild, I actually went ahead and transferred everything over to the Roland um, file that I created and going into part two. Uh, Check out some of the some of the vocals. Closer. Hey, baby. Change. So there you have it, um, hopefully now you have the knowledge to uh, fix a corrupt file once you download a zip file um, using WinWar and now that everything seems to be working flawlessly I have a lot of digging around to do to figure out which one of these will be my favorites and I can utilize with my new gear but there will be another video on that coming soon. So if you enjoyed this video, please leave me a thumbs up. Leave comments down below if you would like to see something in particular. Um, share this video. Be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell while you're at it. Um, once again, thank you for watching this video. It's your boy T-Sticks. And make sure y'all hydrate.